Hey guys, Dimanta here from my dear 4K and the Samsung Galaxy Note 9 was officially introduced by Samsung on August 9th which was like a week ago so today I'm gonna be telling you guys about the top new features of the Galaxy Note 9 so let's get started So the main feature is the all new S Pen. You guys already know about the Galaxy Note's main difference when compared to any other flagship device. It is that the Note has a stylus named the S Pen which is pre-installed to the phone. This time with the Note 9 it is even more powerful that the S Pen now supports Bluetooth. So you can take photos, take selfies, wake and lock the phone just by the S Pen without even touching the phone. The next best feature is the battery. You all know what happened to the Galaxy Note 7 which had a big battery. After that disaster, Samsung planned on reducing the battery capacity on the Note 8 to 3300mAh. But this year, they took a big risk and increased the battery capacity of the Note 9 to 4000mAh, giving you an all-day experience. The only problem on the Note 8 was the not-so-good battery. But with the Note 9, they have fixed it and made it the best smartphone built by Samsung ever. The next on list is performance and storage. The Samsung Galaxy Note 9 is yet the best smartphone made by Samsung. It has 8 gigs of RAM and a Snapdragon 845 which can make it faster than any other Galaxy phone and also because of its performance you can now play Fortnite on the Galaxy Note 9 for the first time in an Android phone. Fortnite will be only available for Galaxy Note 9 users till the next month and for the first time I have seen a smartphone which has 512 GB of storage which is also expandable up to 1 terabyte by putting an SD card. Simply, this thing will never run out of storage. Next in list is the AI camera. The Note 9 has a dual camera setup, a 12 megapixel primary camera with an aperture of f1.5 and f2.4, and another 12 megapixel 2 into optical zoom lens with an aperture of f2.4. You guys know that the Samsung Galaxy S9 was released with an amazing camera where you can switch between two apertures. That was the first time where you have a variable aperture in a smartphone. But with the Note 9 camera, not only you have amazing hardware, but the software is also highly improved than the S9. The AI in the Note 9 will help you to take the best possible shot by optimizing color, white balance, contrast and exposure based on person, scene, landscape, food or animal. Also if there is an error in the shot, for example if the person has closed his eyes then a bubble will pop up and the AI will show you that there is an error in the shot. In my opinion, this may have the best camera in a smartphone for the time. Moving on, the final top feature in the Galaxy Note 9 will be the AI UX and Extras. AI UX is the updated version of the Samsung Experience UI. This will be running on the Note 9 and is mainly based on Bixby. Samsung has taken a huge step forward in Bixby and all the AI. The AR emoji is updated. It is a little bit better than the S9. Also, it has a lot of AI camera features which I just talked about. The always on screen memo will be displayed in the same color of this pen which will make it look more fancier. Coming to extras, these are the small things which did a big improvement. The position of the fingerprint is now easy to reach. If you can remember in the Note 8, it came like this, which was way harder to reach. A lot of people complained about it and then Samsung realized the mistake and released the S9 like this. And in the same way, they released the Note 9. Then comes the Dex mod. In the Galaxy Note 8, we had to buy a separate dock to connect it to a monitor and get a PC like experience but in the Note 9 you don't need to spend a lot of money on a dock. All we need is a cable then we are good to go. Finally the headphone jack. Even after putting a big battery, a big 6.4 inches display and a stereo speakers still they haven't removed the headphone jack. I am glad they did that because a lot of phones in 2018 does not have a headphone jack and the Note 9 which have a headphone jack will be more worth. Because of all these features, this smartphone is a complete beast. At the time, not a single smartphone can fight against a Note 9. In my opinion, this is the best smartphone till date. Comment down below which is your favorite new feature. And also, if you want to see more videos like this, subscribe and hit the bell icon. So that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I'll see you guys in another video. Peace.